Good day, people! Today I'm so excited because I'm going to talk about my favorite tea! Kusumi tea! Oh, I'm sorry, yeah. Kusumi tea! Yay! Where's your crap? Yay! This Kusumi tea made me love Russian tea so much. So in Kusumi tea, there are so many kinds of teas. Um, recently, they are more focusing on um, herbal tea or something non-caffeine tea, something infusion like that. But traditionally, they started from Russian black teas. So uh, they have a lot of blendings, but uh, the most famous blendings are um, continued from 70 years ago. The first um, the founder, the Mr. Uh, Kuzmichov, and they made huge success in Russia. So they made a lot of branches in many countries until um, World War, and then they couldn't expand more, and their um, sons failed the business. So. They are just struggling in their business. If you want to know about more history of uh, Kusmi tea, then you can refer to their homepage. They are always um, talking about their history so much. So one of long seller, best seller, this Kusmi, uh, Prince Vladimir, is one of the, the original recipe of Kusmi tea. And I very love this tea so much. This tea has very a lot of flavor and so great. And when you drink tea, then it's... 12 seconds later. A few moments later. One eternity later. So anyway, are you going to talk about Kusmi tea? Prince Vladimir today. Today, before we start talking about Kusmi tea, I just want to notice you that you are already ready to drink teas. Don't be afraid. You already have all the things to drink tea. Don't be afraid. Because a lot of people have this teaspoon in their house. And this is infuser. You can make tea very easily. And this is teaspoon from Kusmi and it looks very professional but it's copper and it's working as like just normal teaspoon so what i want to say is all of those different looking teaspoons they have just the same same work when you make tea what you need is 200 milliliter of water and one teaspoon of tea leaves and those all of these teaspoons they can measure three grams of tea leaves so even you don't have this kind of something uh, luxury and something profession spoons you can just measure by your teaspoon the name teaspoon means it's just not like the spoon when you're using drinking tea teaspoon means um, you can measure three grams of tea leaves by this spoon so i'm going to show you how those spoons just working as same first i'm going to measure by this normal teaspoon what we need to do is just um, pick up by um, spoonful of tea leaves this will be three grams so this one spoon is becomes like this next we're going to use this infuser see Impuser, impuser, yeah, not much, just one side of impuser. So, this amount will be this. And here is my Kusumi tea measure spoon. So, I just going to spoon like one spoon, like this. So this is the uh, exact amount of Kusmi tea leaves. So this will be like this. Can you see? Can you see? They are just the same. So you don't need to operate, measure your tea 
because you already have your teaspoon, it means you can measure any tea just correctly. So don't afraid and just get tea leaves and drink. Very easy. Easy, easy la. So today I'm going to talk about my favorite this uh, Prince Vladimir and please just let me explain what's inside of this tea. So um, it says uh, ingredients are black tea, orange peel, uh, essential oils of bergamot and grapefruits and lime and other flavorings. Then I'm going to show you how the tea looks like. So I'm going to show you how tea leaves and inside looks like in this thing. So I'm going to this, open this and remove this thin seal. And then you can see this sea of tea leaves. Can you see? Yep, there's my spoon. So there are tea leaves and those white thing, they are um orangey feeling I think um, now actually I don't know which one is grapefruits or I have no idea so inside of the tin looks like this isn't this graceful I'm crying so I'm going to make my tea from now and what you need is just 3 grams of tea leaves and 200 milliliter of water and 4 or 5 minutes, that's all and then let's squeeze the teas Why me? Why me? <laughs> Five minutes past it. Let's drip it. Ah! Yeah, that's it. So, okay. This is it. Then let's try the tea. So I'm going to tell you how can you enjoy three times more um, better way to taste your tea. First, um, when you have your tea, check the color by your eye. So enjoy the this great beautiful color of tea. Your eyes, hmm, beautiful. And second thing, check the sense. Mm. So nice. And then you can taste it. Mm. So just don't drink tea directly. Um, when you, if you try to drink tea, like hold up in your mouth and just wait for a second, then you can find more taste and more sense very easily. Try it. So why I love this tea is because it's super well balanced tea because sometimes it's too sweet or sometimes it doesn't have any taste. There are so many unbalanced tea in this world. But this Prince Vladimir has very well balanced taste and scents both over so you can enjoy everything of this tea. Color, scents and taste, everything is just good so the taste of this tea is like uh, it has quite a uh, strong and heavy taste of black tea but it has a very uh, soft scent such as uh, vanilla as well and it includes a sense of flavor of um, bergamot as well so 
Uh, taste itself is similar with Earl Grey, but there are a more orange peeling or um, what was that? Uh, grapefruits or lime as well. So not only the the um, black um, black tea, but also you can taste the fruity um, freshness as well. So when you drink this tea, then you can taste the uh, black tea and lime grape and uh, flavor of orange and bergamot and the hidden scents such as a star anise or cinnamon um, spices it helps and improves this tea so much so strongly i recommend you this prince vladimir from kusmi tea if you never tried kusmi tea or if you never tried uh, prince vladimir then I really recommend you to try this first. Um, actually, they had this size of tin can before, but no longer they have this size. They only sell this um, little, little thin, small thin, and this medium size thin. So if you are living in Japan or South Korea or such like uh, big uh, tea countries, then I guess there's a tea shops or you can find uh, Kusmi tea from internet. But if you are living in um, Malaysia or Singapore or such as a um, not really that big market of black tea, then maybe it will be a little bit difficult to find this tea. Singapore, they had a boutique just a few years ago, but they already closed it even before COVID. So I am really so sorry and sad about that. Why me? Why me? <laughs> Are you watching Kusmi Tea Marketing Team? Please come to Malaysia, please. Thanks for watching today's video as well and if you like this video and if you want to know more about this then please check my channel and please check my another video in the future. Then see you next time and enjoy your day. Bye bye!